Значит, защитная признала вину. Вот, она обратила внимание сюда, что совершила она этот поступок по неосторожности, не, не намеренно. Соответственно, все детали будут, наверное, чуть позже. Еще будет работать защита, еще будут наши свидетели допрошены в следующих заседаниях. Поэтому вот пока просто сообщаем вам, что сегодня произошло. She's a responsible person, and uh, she admitted that uh, it was uh, her, hers, but she said that it was unintentionally brought to to Russia because she was in a in a hurry as she was packing, and it was just by accident it ended up in, in her luggage. I was able to speak with Ms. Greiner in the courtroom. Uh, she said that she is eating well, she is able to read books, uh, and under the circumstances she is doing well. Most important, I was able to share with Ms. Greiner a letter from President Biden, and Ms. Greiner was able to read that letter. I would like again to emphasize the commitment of the United States government at the very highest levels to bring home safely Ms. Greiner and all U.S. citizens wrongfully detained, uh, as well as the commitment of the U.S. Embassy in Moscow to uh, care for and protect the interests of all U.S. citizens detained or imprisoned in Russia.